What's up guys and welcome to another video and let's get ready to wake up and react to another episode of Summertime Render Season 1 Episode 13. Uh, last time he... Mm, sorry, I should give character names. Um, Shinpei <clears throat> st stuck it through the whole loop uh, to the end so that he could kind of figure out what the plan was. Um, and so... God, can I even remember last episode? All of this really is to keep their mom alive. So the dad, their dad, um, I think I wrote her name down finally. Um, is it to Tokiko or something? Yeah, Tokiko. Um, so sister Tokiko, she has been the chosen one since I think... He didn't think that So would be on board with it, or maybe he couldn't handle it. Um, or wouldn't be down with sacrificing people on the island, I guess. But, well, I don't know if they're really sacrificing. I think they said that four people die a year on the island. I don't think that's... I don't think the shadows are stepping in. They're probably from natural causes, but they're letting her feed on them. So it's like a sacrifice to their god. So that the mom can live. Because if the goddess dies his wife will die um and so they also think that if i guess the deal is if he keeps helping her so tokiko's dad so's dad keeps helping the goddess uh what's her name hiruko then she'll fix his wife or the copy of her i should say um and i guess the kids never knew that she was a shadow which i guess you wouldn't they're, if they're a faithful copy but you see my question though is is like how is she not evil then is she like um ushio otherwise i feel like is the whole nice mother act like is it fake yeah you have all of their memories but that doesn't mean you are them ushio's was she was but the rest of them are not i mean they're evil but anyway we'll see we'll see what happens i don't know we haven't met her i mean she seemed nice well, that was a photo. Maybe that was their real mom that we saw. That little flash image we, we got of her. So, I don't know. We'll see, though. But, yeah, they went back in time again. Him and Ushio together. He took her with. And now, I think where they are picking up is when they were talking to... Or when Shinpei was talking to um, Hizuru and um, Nezu in the forest. Like, giving them the whole backstory on him and everything. But yeah, other than that, I don't really think there's anything else to say about it or recap. So yeah, let's jump into the reaction, guys. Still marked. Wow. Even through a different loop? Mm. Let's get the backstory first. なるほど。君が観測する世界が事実なのに、両方で汚染したんだね。で、でも今まで俺にそんな力があるんか。その目は欠けてできているということ。Made of shadows? She did though on the boat, I remember that. Good plan. Hey, bro. Whoa. Oh, are, is he giving them all of these memories? Oh, that's sick. Or she did. Sorry, she gave him all the memories. Oh, just... Okay. Yeah, I left a message. Yeah. Yeah. What is it, like the end of the world? Yeah, 
Yeah, that's true, I guess. That's just a part that she extended. Or separated from herself. ちょっと待って。Cause this happened before that, right? Hmm. Alright, now I have a question. Why did she look like a blob in the chair before and now she looks normal? Why? Alright, maybe we'll get it explained or maybe it was just that they didn't want to show you who it was yet. Like, um... You ever seen Ruby, where all the background characters like are black shadows because they're not important? Maybe it's kind of the same concept here. Like, this character's not important yet. You don't need to know who they are, so we're just going to make them look like a regular, like, shadow blob. I don't know. That's weird to me. <laughs> Whatever. What's wrong with the copy of his wife, by the way? Like, why is she in a wheelchair? Was his real mom sick? So if you copy them, you copy their illness, if they have any. Man, she looks like a badass, that nurse. I wonder if she's a shadow. Who was that? I wonder if it's someone we know. Run to mommy. My mother is calling, unless it, they meant like... I thought they meant like the person they're pretending to be. Maybe he meant... Hiruko? Yeah, she was doing that. いや、Wow. How did you end up with that ability, though? Like, to see the future by a couple seconds. Yeah, you know what I remember? That's like the same ability um, as... God, I can't remember the character name. Jobless reincarnation. Damn. Rudy. Kill them all. Well. Except for Shiori. Where is, um, Ushio? She's his watch? Cool. <laughs> Her outfit's so cute. <laughs> <笑>ちょっと。次のループにも突かされる。あ、すごい。のベランダから潮りが降りてきます。And Fuck. Is she dead? Guess they remember too. 
<gasps> oh my god. Oh man, if you come back again, she's dead. Permanently. I don't... Ah, uh, man. Fuck you. Mmm. It can track you anywhere. In any timeline. Uh, fuck these people. <gasps> oh, her face, I hate her. Oh, my God. Shit. Just a greeting? Did I, how did I miss him dying? Oh, okay, so you didn't. Oh, she did that! <gasps> Holy shit, dude. It's probably an extension of her then? Or no? Maybe she made it. I don't know, man. Where are you? He's glowing. This is like, is this a different timeline? Like, like a previous one? Uh, it's before then. <gasps> that that sounds like. Oh no! Doesn't sound like the person he was on the phone with. That's you're way in the past. That's Rinosuke. Holy shit! I chills. Bro. Oh. You can see how they died. I feel like they died under mysterious circumstances. Like, then they die out at sea. Oh. Is that his dad behind him? <laughs> he knows. He knows just how to get to her. He needs a shave. <laughs> this has to be nice to see his parents like this. You start to forget how they look, right? <laughs> oh, a shadow. This is when her brother died, maybe? Well, I don't know, because her other friend is here, so... Maybe not. Mm. Yeah, yeah, it is, I guess, technically. By Heine and all her shadows. Uh, do they get like ambushed on the way home? I know her brother dies. I, just, I don't. I didn't think that her friend was around to see it though. There she is. Did she not want to come around when she knew other people were there? You look so nice, fake. I guarantee it. So bright. Oh my god. <sighs> I felt like that was a boring episode. I felt like my mouth didn't even change. Never, sorry, my mouth. Like, 
I felt like I didn't talk that much. I felt like my face didn't change much. Um, but whatever. Sometimes you just have those episodes. Um, I don't really know what to say about it. Oh, fuck. Where do I start? Um, I think Mother is... She lures people in and then she was probably planning on eating, um, I don't know what to call her, um, Nagumo or Hizuru, I don't know. They were, I don't know, maybe she was planning on eating her or maybe she was planning on using her to get more meals or more information, something. She's using her for something, I don't know why. But I don't know why she ended up killing her brother instead. That's what I don't get. Like, why kill her? Why not kill her, you know? Um, and then for, um, God, this is like running so loud. Be quiet. Take that off the screen. It should help. Um, and then Shinpei being able to go into the past, or maybe not really, more into like someone's memories, but still, we're finding out as the season progresses, there are just more and more uses to this eye than he thought originally. So now he knows that, one, he can go back in time. Hang on. I keep getting messages. I just want to make sure it's nothing important. I have to leave in like 30 minutes. Okay, got to make this quick. All right, so um, he can go back in time or to loop. But I think he can go further back than he thinks. That's my guess. He might even be able to go forward in time. Not that we want to do that right now. But, um... Honestly, if you have her eye, maybe you can do almost as much as Hyane. You're not a shadow, so your your options or your abilities are probably limited somewhat. Um, but still, I mean, she can, like, extend herself. Like, before, he didn't think he could bring people with him. He brought um, uh, Ushio with him, but maybe that's just because she's a shadow. Like, he was, but, um, and then Ushio, she was able to, since she, he brought her with him, she has all the memories from the previous timelines. She copied the data, maybe. And then she was able to share that with um, Hizuru and Nezu, which was useful, but, or, well, we thought it would be, but really it wasn't because Mother remembers everything. She's been tracking him since the first timeline, the first loop. And um, I guess it wouldn't be the first loop. It'd be the first timeline, wouldn't it? Uh, anyway, so... <sighs> She can find him no matter where he is. She killed Nezu and Hizuru inst instantly. I mean, that thing that she made, the father, I think she made him. Because she said, Ushio said she couldn't copy it. Like, there was, like, no data. It was empty. So, I think that means because, it's because that thing is an extension of mother. It's, I don't know, man. I, that thing is, like, oh, unbeatable. It feels like he's able to predict people's movements. And, you know, maybe he is because he's seen, you know, through Mother, seen so many different timelines that people, you know them so well, they're predictable. Especially since you've known Hizuru for as long as you have. I mean, how many years in the past is this? Like, 10 years, maybe? Around then? Or, yeah, probably around 10. 10 to 12. I don't know how old she is now, but she was probably, like, 14 there in that flashback. She might be, like, 24 now. Maybe later, later 20s. i say like 12 years tops. But yeah, I don't know. I mean, hopefully this will be useful to him. Like if you can see how their relationship started, maybe you'll get more information on her, on Heine. Um, Maybe you can figure out how your parents died because I'm assuming the way that his parents died is somehow related to this whole story. I just don't know how because his parents died out at sea. That's a little suspicious to me. Like we just covered up. I'm sure there was, they said there was, minimal investigating i think so it's just fishy it's just fishy fishy all over and then um i want to know who so was talk or so's father was talking to on the phone he's like oh i gotta go my mother's calling me oh yeah run away to your mommy like were you talking to a shadow all right duh he was probably talking to a shadow now this shadow were they talking about Heine or were they talking about like their cover like whoever they copied like they're pretending to be them so maybe you're talking about like their parents their mom i don't know 
I don't know if that's important, but now I'm going to start looking out for, like, kids, I guess. I feel like, was I supposed to recognize that voice? I don't know if I was. For a second, I thought that voice sounded similar to Rinosuke's, I'm sorry, Rinosuke, uh voice, but I don't think they were the same. But yeah, I don't know. Did you guys notice anything that I didn't? Did you guys pick up on anything else that I didn't? I don't know. I don't know where this is going to go. I really don't know how you defeat her, honestly. I'm, I'm at a loss. I mean, this lady, she's OP. So is her weapon, um, father. And she knows where you're going to be at all times, pretty much, because she can track you. So you don't really have that much of a head start. Now you're probably fine because you're just in someone's memories. But the second he lands into a new timeline, she'll be on him instantly. So I, I don't know. I don't know what you do. I don't know. Well, whatever. Anyway, I don't know. I that that take it slow. I don't know what else to say about the episode, so I'm gonna zip it. I gotta uh, buy movie tickets. We're gonna go see Top Gun Maverick. So, yeah. Anyway, remember to like, share, and subscribe, and hit that notification bell to be notified every time I upload a video. And if you guys want full reactions, you can catch that on my Patreon. The link for that's in the description below. So please check that out and sign up to support the channel. Other than that, I'm gonna get out of here, guys, and I'll catch you in the next reaction.